Labor Day weekend is days away and it's a good time to check in on small businesses. Talking with the local experts who survey them every few months, we know right now confidence levels are dropping and things could get even more stressful heading into the fall and winter. Philip Townsend explains. We've been following the state of local retail all throughout the pandemic. Businesses, they continue to work through unprecedented times. So we called Kylie Ross Seibert at Retail Alliance in Norfolk to check back in. They're wrapping up their latest retail pulse survey. The last one was done in April. The, there was a lot of confidence back in April, like the level of confidence was a lot higher. So what's showing in this survey is that although there is still some confidence, the level has dropped. And that's because a lot's happened since then. Most recently, the rise of the Delta variant and surging case numbers nationwide. But even before that, this last five-month stretch has presented a host of problems for local retailers. As we all know, staffing shortages, you know, you can see just, you know, driving down the street, just how many signs up for, you know, positions open. They're not going to get immediate relief ahead of the Labor Day holiday weekend. But September is bringing a potential fix to that staffing issue. Federal unemployment benefits and September 4th, that could push more people into these vacant positions. But the bigger issue could come months from now, from electronics to cars and so many things in between, the supply chain remains a problem for local businesses. And it means once again, they could be heading into the major holiday shopping season with a lot of unknowns. You know, the holiday season is such a big, big issue. And you know, the fourth quarter is so important for retailers that getting that product in time is, you know, it, it's a bit scary right now. For 13 News Now, I'm Philip Townsend. The Retail Pulse surveys small businesses all over Hampton Roads. They'll do another survey before the Christmas shopping season, so we'll be sure to check back in and update you.